Alright, so first I do apologize for squinting, that light is so bright in my face. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, hang on, I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> so I'm doing a Q&A, and I don't normally do Q&As. In the description of all my videos, it says I do one every week. I only just found that out. Yeah, that's bullshit, I don't do one every week. Anyway, we're doing a Q&A now, because my documentary trailer just released yesterday, I think so, yep. And my documentary is releasing February 19th, which is just around the corner. Well, actually, this has been recorded in mid-January, but, well, early January. The documentary's coming, ladies and gentlemen, just admit that. I got my coffee, I got my questions from you guys. Some of them aren't about the Q&A, some of them are. Some of you guys are just twats, like, for example, the first one here is, um, uh, you look like a twat. That's literally the first question, ladies and gentlemen. You look like a twat. It's not even a question, it's a statement. Anyway, let's begin, shall we? Why? Question. Because I just felt like it. Now, now, this documentary is like a school project I made last year. Um, so that's why. Because I had to do it to pass my school. Looks like you're doing bits. Good job. Thank you, sir. Pretty sure you're a sir. You might be a man, I don't know, I just get given these without an account, so I just get given these. Looks like you're doing bits, good job, eh? Thank you very much. It's not a question, though, so get out. Piss me off, wasting my time, man, wasting my time. What are you doing after this? Um, I would like to say take a nap, um, however, I'm not. We have, I have, uh, infinite time. Ryder Austin searching for reason and how far still devil to do, which are more movies I'm making, and then I'm taking a nap, and then I'm gonna take a big nap. Favorite movie? Um, do you mean movie that I've made or of all time? I'll tell you what, I'll just give you both. My favorite movie of all time. I'm one of those guys who likes Avengers. But I do like Creed, Kingsman, love me some Toy Story. I just watched Bugs Life. Banging movie, Bugs Life. Should make a sequel, Bugs Life 2. I'd do it, I'd be in it, I'd watch it. Favorite movie I've made. Obviously I've got my movie posters up here. Can't really see it, but I'll put it on the screen. Favorite one, How Fast the Scarlet. That's probably my favorite one. Best part of the documentary, or the best part of the documentary is my friend Xavier, because he just comes with the, the funniest questions, oh sorry, funniest answers to the questions, like for example, this one. I didn't really read the script, so I couldn't be bothered, honestly, so I just read it two minutes before, and I, I didn't like what he said really in it, because it wasn't a reflection of my personality, so I kind of changed it up. Why is your brother such a yeah, he, he's just, he's just lonely. Yeah, he didn't read my script, and it kind of breaks my heart, it still breaks my heart to this day. So, not a fan of that at all. What does PKCU stand for? Um, so when I made the first movie back in 2016, I named it the PKCU, which at the time was called Phoenix Kid Cinematic Universe which uh, is a direct copy from Marvel and it's very cringe and I really hate the name. So I swapped it around and I changed it to PK Cinema Universe or Phoenix Kid because for those who don't know, my first YouTube name was Phoenix Kid. And obviously I grew up, I'm 20 next year. I'm 20, not even, no, not even next year, this year. I'm 20 in March. I'm even 20 in March, that's absolutely so dumb. What is the documentary about? So the documentary is about me. No, the documentary is about how I started YouTube 10 years ago and how we formed this essentially rip-off Marvel studio. Started with one film, moved along to four, three this year, and how they're just all connected. Like, I'm not too sure if I say this in the documentary, so I'll say right now, the first film was a piss take. It was all essentially like, just like a random idea in my head, like, yo, I want to do this. And then we just kept doing it and it just got way too ridiculous. I'm literally filming every single day for movies. Currently this whole month of January, I've just been doing Ryder Austin Searching for Reason every single day. And we've almost finished it and it doesn't come out until June, which is so relaxing and calm for me because I film it all in June and then I could just take a fucking break. And I'm just like, yeah, we're going to take a break. Well, essentially not because I have other stuff to do and I've moved into my own house um, So it gives me a lot more freedom to film. It's one in the morning, right? It's one in the morning I couldn't do that back at home. This this next one is not a question. It is a statement and it says okay So okay to you too. Why a documentary? Um, it's what I was studying at school. I didn't really have a choice <laughs> I did enjoy it though. I, I loved studying documentary and making documentaries oh it was so sick and um i want to get into it too like my dream as a kid was to grow up and make movies but like nah screw that like not big movies i just want to make these small youtube movies that i've been doing recently and then um i want to make like some documentaries oh there's so many documentaries on. i want to make a documentary on my mate xavier on his basketball 
I want to make a documentary. I want to make so many documentaries. I won't say them all, but I love documentary making. And um, I thought this would have been a good one to start with because I know it off by heart and I know exactly what I want to do and what to say. So that's actually all the questions I have time for. Well, actually, it's not. I've got plenty of time. I'm just saying it's all the questions I got. You gave me fuck all questions. I put out a thing on Instagram saying, give me some questions and this is what you come back with. Someone called me a twat. That's not even a question. Someone just said, okay. I got violated in my own Q&A. Anyways, I'm gonna bed. I'm going to go to bed and I'm probably gonna go watch um, A Bug's Life again because it's just a banging movie. So, oh God. All right, bet. Watch the documentary when it releases February 19th on YouTube slash PK Hectic. Um, 40 minutes long. I had to read that. 40 minutes long. That's all it takes. It's 40 minutes long. That's all it takes. 40 minutes. Okay, it takes three and a half hours to watch the first four movies, and it takes 40 minutes to watch a documentary about all the movies. The fucking Chad, say your name. Chad. Hi, guys. Hi, right, welcome, welcome to the class. Welcome back to school. Wish you had, had a nice holiday. Did you have a nice holiday? How about you? How about Chad? How about you stand up and tell us about your holiday? Um, Sit the fuck down. Shut up. Um, We're gonna do some learning now. Okay. Now, of course, for those who don't.